December 2021? This is a question only one person in the world can answer. Mr. Chikata, why wouldn't you limit? I'm sorry? Why wouldn't you limit your references to the EC, to the office, the chairperson rather than the personality? Well, it seems to me that your attack is against the personality of the person and not the office. So we'll be happy if you just limit it to the chairperson well, or the respectfully, EC, because in her absence, any of the deputies, anybody at all could step in. And respectfully, my lords, respectfully, my lords, there is only one returning officer for the presidential elections. And that is the That returning officer is not the EC. That returning officer is the chairperson of the Electoral Commission. And that, chairperson, that's all. You are not interested. The chairperson has a name. I, 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 I'm not able to mention the name of the chairperson. No, my, my, my lord, respectfully, I, I want to understand. Am I being prohibited from mentioning the name of the chairperson? Is that the issue? Reading through your petition yes. as to the instant application, the constant emphasis on the name, what I'm telling you is that we'll be satisfied just with the designation because in her absence, any of the deputies could act in that position. My lord, so if it is an election petition and you are challenging the election of the president, it is sufficient that the institution charged with the responsibility of conducting that election had done their work and the chairperson who is the head um, represent that institution and not the personality, the name. My lords, with the greatest respect, I believe that the constitutional requirements regarding the returning officer and the particular circumstances that we are dealing with in this case do not make it possible to have the situation that you are envisaging where somebody else steps in for the chairperson. Respectfully, the constitution makes the chairperson and only that chairperson the returning officer and in the circumstances of this case that chairperson happened to be the person that we refer to in the petition and that chairperson actually was the person who undertook her responsibilities in accordance with the various constitutional and legal provisions that we have. So, my lord, we do not mention her name by way of targeting an individual. That is very far from it. My lord, when I cited before you a decision of the Supreme Court, and I cited the decision of Justice Badegbe as an individual judge, he read a unanimous decision of the whole court. I did not target Mr. Justice Badegbe when I mentioned his name, because he happened to read that judgment, which was a unanimous decision of the court. And equally, I do not target Mrs. Jean Adukwe Mensa when I say that she made the declaration on the 9th of December. It's not a targeting, it's just a fact that is material in this particular petition. So thank you. You may continue with your submission. And that is why. In